What's up folks, Sigcorps here, and welcome back to a game that I have, uh, I, have I, I love. I love Skyrim. It's one of my all-time favorite games. I always seem to be rotating back through. This is Skyrim Special Edition, um, and um, we're going to start a new game, a very lightly modded game. Um, yeah, yeah, start a new game. Um, I know Special Edition is supposed to run a lot better, and I was starting to have problems. After upgrading to Windows 10, I was starting to have problems running with Special Edition. And I tried pl playing a very heavily modded, uh, another heavily modded series, and it did not work very well. Um, I kept getting this weird compression issue with the video, and it would get out of sync with the audio, and so what happens is I record, because my... They're, they're about 40 minutes long. It's about how long an episode's going to be. Um, so I would have 40 minutes of audio, but I'd have like 36 minutes of video. And it was weird, because it wasn't like it was just out of sync and I could shrink the audio to 36 minutes. The compression started slow and got bigger, 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 bigger. So if I lined up audio with an action at one point, a minute later, I was out of sync again because the compression had increased just ever so slightly. And so um, I tried a test recording with just vanilla Skyrim Special Edition, and it worked fine, worked beautifully. So I'm just running a few mods. We're running... Uh, alternate life or alternate start, another life Unread Books Glow the unofficial patch for Skyrim Special Edition um, Immersive Armors uh, I'd be running Immersive Weapons too, but they don't have it yet um, we're running one of Eleanor's Ellie's Houses Breeze Home and I might add another one. Uh, it's an upgraded Breeze home. And... There was one other. And what was it? Off the top of my head, I can't remember. It'll be in the description. So, but I didn't want to go through... I didn't want to go through Helgen again. I've replayed this game so many times, and I've seen that whole opening sequence so many times. And I couldn't seem to get a save game to where I could skip the opening sequence and just go straight into the whole you know, what, a character creation bit. Um, the one thing I did say, for those of you who haven't seen, or the one, th yeah, one thing I did see, for those of you who haven't seen, the new opening sequence, they did a lot better job of it. They added in one detail that I love, and that's the fact that you lay your head down on the block and you look up, and instead of Alduin just being there, you watch him fly in and land on the roof. So that's a little nicer. That actually, to me, makes a huge difference. It's like, where, where the hell did this dragon come from? And why all of a sudden am I looking at him? You know, you see him off in the distance fly up and land, you know. So, anyway, on we go. Um, we're going to go with a wood elf. Not, uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, ooh. I forgot how butt ugly they are. Yeah. We're gonna go with a wood elf. I'm, um, the character hook for this, or what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna try is I'm gonna do a, uh, primarily archer character. Um, I've never played one that's primarily archer. Uh, I mean, I've, I've, all my characters have always used bows, but I want one that's primarily archer, and he's. He's not going to be a good guy. He's going to be a more I'm out for myself type guy. Arya, the last character I played, she was more of a... She initially showed up uh, in Skyrim to... She she'd lived uh, in... Um, in Cyrodiil and had come over to see if the rumors were true about the 
the oppression of the Nords because she was a Nord and she wanted to help out. Um, in this instance, um, so she, but she was very good. She was a good character. She was a paladin-esque, if you would, to a point. Um, this guy's going to be more of a, I don't want to say a hedonist, but he's going to be more of a, uh, I'm out for myself type deal. So I don't think we'll go down the thief path. Uh, meaning um, quest line, but we may. Um, so, okay, race. We're gonna go wood elf. So let's go body. Um, let's see presets. Let's go with presets here. What do we got? Mm, oof. Uh, no. Uh, that's not too bad. Let's get a decent starting point here. I think I kind of like that. Nice young kid. Um, skin tone. Can we... This kid is going to be... He's going to have been a merchant's helper. He worked with a trader. Um, and the reason he is in... Oh, 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 hulking. Yeah, no, no, no. He's going to be slight. That's not bad. Um, the reason he is in Skyrim is he got into an argument with a Breton nobleman's kid. Let's... And... Basically, he got into a bar fight with him, and we don't need any of that. Scars, I'm fine with that, that the scars work, although do we want something a little different? Do they have something, no, that's a bit much, a bit much, a bit much. I wish they had something around the eye, like around you know, like here. Um, but I'm, I'm okay with that. More paint? No. No. Bit extreme. Bit extreme. No. No. Uh-uh. Nope. That's not too bad. We'll go with that and then let's change the color a little bit. Mm. That's kind of nice. Nice little faded, a little bit of detail. Okay. Um, I'm okay with that. Uh, and this is just the prelude, by the way. Um, nose type. Let's let's mess with his nose. Uh, yeah. So he's so he's oh god, that's a witch's nose right there. That's not too bad. How's that? That's not too bad. Let's let's we'll go with that. Nose height. It's okay. Nose length is okay. Um, jaw width. Oh, there's a chiseled, chiseled jaw right there. Um, so being a wood elf, he's gonna have had some training in. Yeah, a little too. Yeah. Okay. Jaw height. That's, that's not bad. Jaw forward now. Cheekbone height. Let's... There we go. Um, cheek color. Oh, that's width. Oops. Good there. Cheek color. Is anybody actually even seeing a difference? Oh, there we go. 
Okay. Laugh lines. Uh, cheek lower color. Okay. Nose color. Oh, so you say like a little sunburned. Which would make sense, actually. So, he's fleeing. He had a fight with a nobleman's son who didn't kill him. But... There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Didn't kill him, but... The kid got cut up pretty bad after being hit in the face with a broken bottle. Um... Oh, God, no. Ew. Alien, hello. Can we get back to where we were? Yeah, okay. Um, and he was a minor nobleman's son. And, uh, let's just say... Oh, those aren't bad. No, he's not blind, nor is he a demon. Um, let's just say... Um, eye width. Can we bring the eyes in just a little bit? You know what? Eye shape. Can we? Let's go back to this real quick. That's better. I depth eyeliner color. No, it makes him just look bizarre. Okay. Eye shadow. Um, that's not too bad. Eye tint. There we go. Okay. So he's on the run, and he's come to Skyrim. Um. Okay, okay. Brow type. Um, so that's the reason he's here, and... So he's not... He's not a warrior. Um, he's got some training, you know, he's just like all... No brows. Uh, just like all wood elves, he's gonna have some. He's gonna have some knowledge of hunting and, and and things like that. I mean, he's did it. You know, he did it with his dad and stuff like that before he was apprenticed. Um, I think that's a little better. Yeah. Um. So that's where he's. No. Brow width. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's better. Brow forward. I don't think he needs the Cro Magnon look. Or the Neanderthal look. Okay, mouth. Yeah, that mouth is a little severe. Um No, that's not too bad. Uh, well, that's a little pinched. Okay, let's let's go all the way down here. Basic. Uh, that's not too bad. Uh. Okay. Mouth forward. I mean, my mouth forward. Let's see what we got. Let's see what the profile looks like. Oh, it's like he's got big teeth. There we go. That's not too bad. Um, and coming, uh, pointy. There we go. Chin length. A little better. Chin forward. Um, do, 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 do. Okay, that's not too bad. Look color. 
And turn your head back, please. Lip color. That's not bad. Okay. Hair. This hair has got to go. No. No. Oh God, no! It makes him. That makes him look like a vampire. Um, he was a merchant helper, so. So while he has some experience, that's not horrible. With, uh, you, you know, light weapons coming, that's not bad either. I'm gonna braid down the back. Makes him look a little too girly. No. Oh, no, he's not old, so. That is a woman's hairstyle. I'm sorry. Well, okay, maybe not. But that looks very too. Um. That's not horrible. Nor is that. Okay. Facial hair. Honestly, I'm thinking none. He's he's younger. You know, he's, you know, uh, no, he's. Um, I would say, or that, or or that. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, I don't remember how long the elves live, but say late teens, early twenties, probably early twenties. Hair color. That's not too bad. That doesn't look right with his complexion. Hmm. That's not too horrid. That's not bad. And so I'm not running, like I said, I'm running a very lightly modded game, which I'm hoping doesn't tax the computer. Blonde, I don't see him as a blonde. But I don't mind that. Okay. And again, this is the prelude. Um, I, I think we got him. Um, and the name he's going to be using is not his true name. Um, and he's coming over from from Valenwood um, and has escaped. This is left. He, he left town uh, because this this, uh, not only is the law looking for him, not horribly so, but this minor nobleman's son wants him dead, because he, he cut his face up pretty good. Mm. Sorry, sip of coffee. That's not bad. You know what, though? Let's... Let, let, let's... Hello? Can we... Can we back up here? I, I need to... That nose. I have, I have to fix the nose. Uh, face. Nose. Let's work on this nose a little bit. Can we... Something that fits his face a little bit better. Is that how's that? Ooh, there's a nose you could chisel with. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm.
Oh, God, no. Ooh. Um, that's better. What about that, that last one there? No. There we go. Okay. I, I think we're done there. Although, let's lower it just a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Okay. We are done. Okay. Yep, finish the name of the character. And he's going to be called Denier. So, that's the name he's chosen. Is Denier. He's on the run. He had a different name. So let's... Okay. Now. Okay, so we got... Oh, I'm sorry. Immersive Armor is Unread Books Glow. Uh, th this is... Um, not Live Another Life. This is uh, Alternate Start. A s yeah. I I'll list them. I'll list them. So, okay. So okay, now we choose... And choose where your new life shall begin. Okay. I'm going to say we arrived aboard a ship. Uh, I own property, one of the holds. I'm a new member of a guild. Patron of the local inn. Soldier in the army. No, I got caught crossing the border. <laughs> Illegally. <laughs> I want to escape the cell. Out on the wilds. Vigilant of Stendar. Camping in the woods. So you could actually become... We could jump straight into the uh, vampire quest line. The um, Dawn Guard. Shipwrecked off the coast. I'm a vampire in a security lair. Necromancer, secret location, a warlock's thrall. Attack left for dead. Surprise me. Uh, I'm going to say we, we've we, we arrived on board a ship. Which city did you sail to? Um. I'm going to say solitude. A life filled with opportunity awaits you, traveler. Now use the events to choose a new life for yourself. Use the empty bed to begin your new life. There's an empty bed. Oh yes, an empty bed. Okay. So, this is it. This is the beginning of Denier's adventures. And... Let's let's get to a place where we have light. Let's go over here where there's some light. And um, here's Denier. Uh, a, a wood elf trader's assistant, merchant's assistant, who got drunk and, um, you know, beat up on some nobleman's kid and scarred him for life. So, but, uh... Like I said, he's not a good guy, but he's not a horrible guy either. He's just kind of out for himself. He just wants to live at this point. So, um, this ends the prelude, and um, we'll see you next time. Um, and we'll get started. Alright. See you in episode one. Bye now.